All right, now the Red Sox are on pace to have a fucking unbelievable year. But I don't, I don't know if I'm buying it. And I was looking at some stats earlier. You know, just trying to figure out what the Red Sox struggle with, and I found a stat that was very interesting. They're 17 and 14 against left-handed pitchers, and you know, I was thinking, what the fuck, like Mookie Betts, J.D. Martinez, like wouldn't wouldn't they absolutely fucking tear up lefties? But you know, it's what it's telling me is they're facing a lot of shitty righties. Especially in the AL East, you know, even even the Yankees, their pitching is not amazing. You know, it's better now. You know, I like Hap is a nice acquisition there, especially if you look at that stat against the Red Sox. Because assuming that if the Yankees win that wild card game, it's going to be Yankees Red Sox. But you know, another thing, I just. They beat the fuck out of the Blue Jays, the Orioles, and the Rays. Like, it's not like, it's not like Houston. Houston has to play Seattle, Oakland, and the Angels are also a good team, you know? So, it's not like you're fucking facing garbage everywhere. And you might be saying, well, what about the fucking Indians? Well, we know the Indians are fucking good because... They made the World Series, and then they had 100 wins, and then, you know, they lost to the Yankees. But, you know, the Yank- or the, the Indians are an established team. We know they're good. The Red Sox have been first-round exits the last two seasons, and I don't know if anything different happens this year. I mean, I'm not even a big fan of the Yankees either. These two powerhouses that we have this season, I mean, they don't... They don't fucking scare me as much as Houston or Cleveland at all. I mean, Oakland. If they're playing Oakland, I would have no fucking problem taking the Red Sox or the Yankees. But, man, I don't know about them. Especially the Red Sox. You know, the Yankees, too, actually. They, they're they both so fucking one-dimensional. The Red Sox... They don't really have amazing pitching. They've got Sale, Kimbrell. Other than that, there's no one that scares me. No one. I'm not fucking scared of Rick Porcello in the playoffs. I'm not scared of David Price in the playoffs, I'll tell you that. I'm not scared of Eduardo Rodriguez and all those other guys they got there. Severino, I mean, he's been fucking struggling lately. He, He scares me, but, you know, Hap's a good pitcher. Other than that, it's fucking garbage. Oh, my God. You know, they went all out on the bullpen. I don't know if you I don't know if you do that, man. You got to get those fucking starters. And they're so reliant on the home run. They saw a stat the other day, 49.9% of the Yankees' runs come off of home runs. We know what that means. My fucking team, the Blue Jays, a few years ago, Back-to-back years, all home runs, and playoff time, the fucking, that offense is quiet. You know, you're not getting too many fucking runs like that off of Kluber and Carrasco and Verlander and Cole and fucking Keiko and those guys. That's why I think whoever wins the Houston-Cleveland series, assuming that it happens, is going to win the World Series. Because those starters, oh my god, Bauer... And Kluber and Carrasco and and Clevenger, you're not fucking, you're not gonna hit fifty percent of your runs off home runs off those kind of guys. It's just not gonna fucking happen. And if you're the Red Sox, I mean, you've been winning ten six games, nine seven. It's not a lot, a whole lot of two one, three two games, and those are playoff games, you know. Defense wins championships. Or what is it? Offense wins games. Defense wins championships. Pitching wins championships. Offense buys you jerseys. You know? Can't fucking win the World Series without pitching, and neither of those teams really have it. 
You know, it's, it's the fucking Bronx Bombers against Fenway Park. I mean, Fenway Park creates so many runs. We even saw a few weeks ago, or recently, the Indians played the Red Sox, and they beat the fuck out of them. In Fenway. I think it was in Fenway. I don't fucking... It might have not been, but they definitely beat the fuck out of them. And... You know, it's just Andrew Benintendi is not going to be fucking slugging against Corey Kluber. It's not going to fucking happen.